Hey y'all, it's Ellie, AKA Ellie Talks Money. Welcome back to my channel. I am so excited to have you guys back in here for another video. Listen, we are all about helping you to start and scale your business, leverage digital marketing and digital products, business credit to get you some capital and just overall create multiple income streams so you can live your best life. So in today's video, we'll actually be talking about the fact that Dunn's numbers are completely changed. You are not going to be using a Dunn's number for certain things in your business. Instead, you'll be using a UEI number. So go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Like this video and let's get right into it because there's a lot I need to tell you guys about this. Let's go. Ellie talks money to create the better days, business, money, life, the Ellie way. All right, y'all, welcome back into the video. So let's talk about the fact that Dunn's numbers are going away. You need a UEI number instead, but I do still wanna make you guys know that you do need a Dunn's number for business credit. So let me explain. First, I wanna set a little bit of a context for those of you who might be new to business credit or to my channel. A Dunn's number stands for Data Universal Numbering System. It is a number that gets assigned to businesses by by Dun & Bradstreet, which is the largest business credit reporting bureau. They've been around for probably a hundred years or more. And their job is to literally track all the businesses in the United States, their scores, their accounts, just all of their repayment history. So that's what a Dunn's number is. Now for years, the Dunn's number has been something every business needs to have in order to generate a Dun & Bradstreet score, AKA a Paydex score. So if you don't have one yet, you still can go get one, okay? Although Dunn numbers are going away it's only as it relates to the US government I'll dive into that in just a second so if you are a business watching this you still do need a Dunn's number in order to build your business credit because of the fact that trade lines still report to Dun & Bradstreet banks and bank balances still report to Dun & Bradstreet as well it's very connected to your EIN number and your industry code all of these things are still working together. So if you want to be able to build great business credit and you want to be able to qualify for business credit cards and lines of credit and loans, you are going to need a Dunn's number. Now, let's talk about where Dunn's numbers are going away or changing. So previously you needed a Dunn's number again to build business credit and in order to get government grants, government contracts, government, anything having to do with the government, financial programs, assistance, anything. And you would register your business with SAM.gov. Now the government has actually changed its contract with Dun and Bradstreet and instead you do not need a Dun's number any longer in order to get government contracts, government grants, government programs or anything of the sort. So if you had a Dun's number previously, here are the steps you need to take if you still want to be able to get government grants, contracts, programs, and etc. So you're going to go to sam.gov, that's S-A-M dot G-O-V, and when you register for an account, if you did not previously have an account with them, you will be assigned an account and then you will get a UEI number. That will be automatically assigned to you when you create an account at SAM.gov. Now, if you already had an account at SAM.gov where you previously registered with a Dunn's number, and I'll use myself as an example, I previously had an account with SAM.gov so I could be getting government contracts under my consulting business. If you are like me, then you are going to get assigned a UEI number automatically. It will either be sent to you via mail, it may be sent to you via email, depending on what information they have from you, or when you go to sign into your SAM.gov portal, you'll receive a notification and a letter that you've been assigned a UEI number. So. If you already were with SAM.gov using your Dunn's number, you don't need to do anything. You will just be assigned a UEI number automatically. 
If you have never registered with SAM.gov, when you go to register, you'll be assigned a UEI number at that time. Now, the important thing is you do wanna save a copy of your UEI number somewhere safe in your computer or in your business notebook because you will need that every time you apply for a grant, anytime you apply for a government contract, really anything having to do with the government. The great thing is though, all of these programs you can access through SAM.gov or grants.gov. So when you log into those portals, they will already assign your UEI number to you when you're filling out applications or things of the sort. So now you guys get an understanding of how DUNS numbers are going away, but for you as a business owner, you'll still need your DUNS number specifically as it relates to building your business credit. Now, here are some of the best ways you can move forward and still be able to access multiple sources of funding. Because of course, I want you guys to build your business credit so you can get that money, but I also want you guys to be tapped in with grants and government contract opportunities and financial assistance programs for businesses through the government as well. And that's why it's so important that you do take these steps to get your UEI number. Previously, you could apply for a government grant simply by getting a DUNS number, but now you're going to need to register with SAM.gov, you're going to need that UEI number, and then that's going to allow you to submit your application, okay? So let's make sure as we continue to grow and scale our businesses that you are using your DUNS number to build your business credit, as well as tapping into getting your UEI number that opens up your business to government grants, government contracts, and so much more. I do wanna give a quick bonus tip about DUNS numbers, specifically as it relates to building your score. So if you're newer to business credit and you just started building or you're about to start building, I want you guys to register at nav.com and I will link down below that website. It's essentially what I call the credit karma of business. You'll be able to see your reports from all three bureaus, Dun & Bradstreet, Experian, and Equifax. You'll also be able to track your business credit score and you'll also be able to build your business credit on that platform. So that'll be linked down below or you can text NAV, N-A-V, to my phone number, 310-564-0065 and I'll send you the link directly. So when you're starting to build your business credit, register at nav.com and when you sign up for their business booster plan, which is only 39 bucks a month, that is actually gonna start building your business credit every month when that payment reports to Dun & Bradstreet. So still, when you sign up for that website, you are going to be asked to enter your DUNS number and again, that is going to be something that you need to build your business credit short term and long term, all right? So comment down below what questions you have on this topic. I definitely want to follow up with you all and do a part two video if that's something you would love. You guys will be able to get all the tools you need to build your business credit effectively in my masterclass. The Business Credit Masterclass is the best business credit program out there. So I'll link that down below and of course I will apply a YouTube discount for my family, my YouTube family. So subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I hope this video broke everything down for you and I will see you guys in the next one.